Flutter setup and installation. Currently we are in section 1 and we are about to check out the second video of this section. So in this video we are basically going to install the required software on Windows, Mac or Linux. So firstly you have to download the Flutter SDK. And then to create Flutter application you have to install either Android Studio or Visual Studio Code. Or even you can use any editor like Sublime Text along with CLI that is command line tools. Now for this course I will be using Android Studio. Now once you install the Android Studio you have to install the required plugin such as Flutter plugin along with Dart plugin. Now before we start setting up Flutter you have to make sure you are connected to the internet throughout the whole process. So go to the browser and simply navigate to this link. The link to this page you will find in the description below the video. So firstly let me show you how to install it on Windows and then we will go for Mac and Linux. So for Windows the first step you have to do is get the Flutter SDK and place it within your C drive as mentioned here. And also make sure you remember this path where you have saved your Flutter SDK. Your next step will be to update your path by adding it to your environment variables. Now once you are done with all of these things, open your command prompt and type flutter doctor. It will actually help you to know what are the missing softwares or tools. Your output will look something like this. Just follow the instructions. Now proceeding, you have to do the Android Studio setup. So download and install the Android Studio and finally set up your Android device as mentioned here. So if you have an Android device then you are good to go. If you don't have it then you have to set up your Android emulator. For that the very first step will be to enable the virtualization in your machine. And next you have to launch the Android Studio and then set up the AVD. So for that make sure you visit this link. In the next step you have to configure your editor such as the Android Studio in our case. And in case you wish to use VS Code so in that case check this tab. But right now I am interested for Android Studio. So here you have to install the plugin such as Flutter and Dart plugin. So these are the steps to install them. So in the next step you have to test your setup. So go to this link and follow the instructions. Now for Mac OS and Linux the steps are almost similar. Like we saw in case of Windows. Just with some minor changes. So let us go for first Mac. So for Mac these are the system requirement and initially here as well you have to first get the Flutter SDK, download it and unzip it. Next you have to add the Flutter tool to your path. So for that down below we have some instructions. How to update your path. Please follow all of these steps step by step. Do not skip any step. And this is one of the most important step where you have to add the Flutter path to the batch profile present in your Mac. So make sure you do it. Once you do it, simply run Flutter Doctor in your terminal. So that you can know what more tools are required for the Flutter setup. Now proceeding down below, you have to do the platform setup. Such as set up your iOS or Android emulator. Now if you are on Mac and wish to run your Flutter application in iOS device, then you have to install the Xcode as well. But I will use Android Studio to run my application on the Android emulator. So I will skip Xcode and go for Android Studio. I recommend you to do the same. So install the Android Studio on your Mac and also set up your Android device or Android emulator. The choice is yours similar to what we saw in case of Windows. And if you are using Android emulator then make sure to enable the virtualization on your machine in case of Mac. And then go to this link and check how to manage your AVDs. Perfect. And down below here configure your editor for your Mac such as Android Studio in our case by installing the Flutter plugin and also Dart plugin. Here are the steps. And your next step will be to test your Flutter setup. Now moving on next. For the Linux the steps are almost similar to that of Mac OS. So kindly go through it. It is totally similar. 
and during installation make sure you do not skip any step read the full article thoroughly now once you are done with the installation launch your android studio and right now i will show you the last step how to install the flutter plugin and also the dart plugin go to configure plugins browse repositories look for flutter plugin now during the whole process make sure you are connected to the internet select flutter and right here it will show you the install option just install it and it will automatically install the dart plugin as well after installation restart your android studio you will find this option start a new flutter project in your launcher screen click on it select flutter application click on next and there you have to provide the path to your flutter sdk which you downloaded as a very first step while setting up flutter so make sure from this three dot icon you provide the path to your flutter sdk fine once you are done let us start creating our first application in flutter from the next video see you there